Hey y'all, John Gann here, Gann's Amazing Racing Farm. Today, me and Tucker are out here spreading some turnip seeds and radishes. What we're doing, we've got some bare areas around here the cows ate down this year. So we're just, I think we spent $170 on seed for turnips and radishes. And we're just going out and broadcasting over some of these poor areas, hoping maybe we can get a little bit of growth out of this stuff. We're a little bit late in the year. We know it, so we're just going to see what happens. We've been told it may work or may not work, but we figured out if we can get a few inches of growth on leaves and then get a few bulbs, that's for that $170 spent, we can go get more out of that than if we bought $170 worth of hay. And doubling that, the radishes, from what I've seen, they act more like carrots and they grow down in the ground and they kind of open holes up and it will help aerate the soil and they will also provide organic matter in the soil so it's kind of a win-win if we can get anything out of it if you all have any experience with it leave a comment tell us how it went your guys experiences and we'll keep you updated on this and let you know how it turns out all we done is we went and borrowed a cedar from my cousin for the four-wheeler we hooked it on the back of the buggy and then we took our GPS out of the tractor and we just hooked it. We stuck, stuck it on the window of the buggy. So we're using that to kind of keep track of where we've been. And we're just going along broadcasting. We're going to come back tomorrow and drag over everywhere to try and help get the seed embedded a little bit faster. We're supposed to have another couple of weeks of some 40 and 50 up to 60 degree weather. At least two more weeks, maybe three. So hoping that'll give us enough time to get a little bit of growth on them. I don't know anything about them, never done them. It was a last minute decision. We're gonna try and see if, if it pays off or if it was a mistake. So leave a comment below, let us know your guys' experiences and we'll keep you posted.